So in today's video, I thought I'd show you a bit of a relic. Um, people still use it because I had a question the other day saying that their DJI Spark, when you put it into sports mode, it didn't work anymore. So he was asking me, uh, is there a way around it? So I thought I'd do, I'll get my Spark out. Now last time I did, I've flown the Spark, it was about two years ago. And to be honest, I did it this morning, I charged up the battery, I charged up the controller. Um, I haven't fully charged the controller, but the battery's been fully charged, so I know that's working. I thought what I'll do while I'm here, I'll just uh, show you some of the stuff if you haven't seen a Spark. I think personally the Spark was the first prototype to what we got now, the Mini 4 Pro. Uh, and when you, when you look at them, they're virtually the same size until you obviously take out the arms on the Mini 4 Pro. But obviously this is 300 grams, this is 249. So big step up, obviously a lot of improvements, but it did have obstacle avoidance on it, which you've got to remember guys. So at its time, it's good. Now this came out in June of 2017. So it's a really old drone, but you can still fly this. If you've still got the DJI Go 4 app, yep, that's what I'm, so many apps to remember, see. So what I thought I'd do, first was to see if it's all gonna work. So I'm just gonna take off the cover um, and my prop protector that I bought at the time. Now, like I said, I've fully charged the battery. Now the battery has got um, 16 minutes of flight time. I usually say 10 minutes for the, uh, for the Spark. I think I've, I've got a couple of batteries. Um, that was pretty easy. Right, so I'm just gonna connect up my phone. Now I'm using my iPhone. Now this could be another problem maybe to do with um, this guy who's having problems. Because I know, I think I was watching Gavin before I came out and did this. He was saying that people were having problems with their Samsung phones to do with the Go 4 app. But I don't know how true that is. Okay, I'm not going to mess about with that. <laughs> Just going to put it that way for the moment. So the first thing we do, we just turn on the controller. Pretty basic control, if, as you can see. When you compare it now, we've got built-in screen. So things have improved, I must say. So that's on. Now I haven't tried out this cable for a while, so I'm not even sure this cable's gonna work. So I've got the Go4 app on there already. Okay, so it's up on the screen. Uh, this device, the Forks Wi-Fi is, is weak, okay. Okay, so the settings, um, let's go back into the drone. I think everything's looking okay. Right, 120 meters, yeah, that's fine. I'm gonna try the sports mode here, but I've got a feeling the drone's gotta be in the, in the sky. Okay, so it's it's saying sports mode, so that, that's good. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get the drone in the air We'll see how it goes. So here we go. We'll see what happens. If I can remember how to, how to start it all up. It's gone back to, okay. Yeah, it's saying it's, I've got a weak signal. I don't think we've got to worry about that. So the first thing is see if we can get it in the air. Take off. The home point has been updated. There Please check it on the map. It's pretty, pretty steady. I'm just going to move it around a bit. Okay. I'm just going to go over the pool. Is that a good idea? Probably not. Right, now, officially, that's supposed to have avoidance. All right, so, yeah, that's working. Bring it back. The dog's watching me now. Okay. I'm just going to put it into sports mode. Uh, 
Okay, that's in sports mode. Okay. So I'm just going to lap, take it out of sports mode, bring it down. Landing. And then we'll have a quick chat. Yeah. I mean, the only thing I can think of, because the guy didn't say to me, was he using Android or was he using iOS? But I can simply say, using the iOS in, um, with the DJI Go 4 app, no problem. Still seems to work very fine. Avoidance thing worked. I could, I've got full control of it. And night 2017, what we talking there? <laughs> so we're talking um, about eight years ago. Yeah, my maths is terrible. Um, eight year old drone. And I haven't used those batteries for over two years. They're still working pretty fine. I don't really know how much power we got on that now. We've got 85%. Let's see if we can get up the... Um, okay, one, one cell was starting to deteriorate a little bit, but nothing, nothing too much. Yeah. I've, I'm pretty happy with that. So, as always, guys, if you've got a, uh, a request... Uh, you want me to try out something. I mean, I do love getting out. I must fly the old Spark again. I had some great funs with that. So anyway, guys, as always, there'll be another video coming very soon. Mm -hmm.